Hey guys, it's me. I'm watching Mountain Dew back again with another video, and today we are in the dark because I got home from my first drive-in. So, oh, the movie we saw was Goosebumps 2, and if you guys don't know, I am a huge fan of Goosebumps. It's probably one of my favorite movies of all time. Well, not of all time. No, of all time. But, uh, yeah, um, also, if you don't know, I want to be a critic when I grow up, so every movie I see, I want to critique, and I was thinking maybe I'd like to share with you guys. So, I really like the movie, of course. It was a great movie. It mostly stayed true to the original book, except for one thing. The slappy character, oh, spoiler, by the way, was kind of nice. Well, no, he was nice. Um, I get that in in the book he was haunted Halloween book, the book within the story. He was um, trying to be a part of their family, but what he really wanted was a mother and all that, so he was trying to be nice. But can't they have made him like that jerky brother who still helped them anyway? They could have just done that. But, um, they didn't, but... Um, the second flaw would be with the poster. I know this probably shouldn't count, but I'm gonna count anyway since it pretty much just came out a little bit ago, I think, right? Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna assume that. So, um, yeah, they didn't do it by the original artist because they're a really good artist and I really think they should have made the artwork because, man, he was good. But, um, <laughs> sorry, um, yeah, the second flaw, I'd say, I mean, third, sorry, um, the third flaw would be that, um, some of the CGI was pretty bad, um, it didn't really look realistic, like, some things I can excuse, because the story is that, Halloween pretty much brings all the product. Slappy pretty much brings all the products in Halloween alive. And some of the stuff it brings to life is plastic. So I can't excuse that because it's most of not real. But the pumpkins, even though they're supposed to look like fruit and just keep the pumpkin shape, the ones that float, uh, they don't. They still just look like plastic. But, um,. I guess the fourth flaw would be that, uh, sorry, I'm just trying to remember. I know I had a couple of flaws. You know, being a critic isn't always the flaws. I know, I'm going from the good stuff, too. Okay. Alright, yeah, I'll just move on to the good stuff for now, until I remember the flaws. Uh, but, yeah, the good stuff is the story was pretty good. Oh, I just remembered a flaw. Um... They use the same twist twice. Um, in the previous one, they they ended it with possibly him being sucked into the Invisible Boy. It wasn't like official, but it was it was a pretty big clue that yeah he was sucked in. And this one, they pretty much just did the same thing. Although this time you do get to see it, and it did look pretty cool. Um, the next thing is some of the effects were pretty good. Um, even though some were bad. And some were amazing. Once again, I have to mention plastic. Sorry, uh, my video cut out, but yeah, I'll just continue. So, um, the plastic ones were good. They had this giant spider, and that looked amazing. Um, and the good parts is they gave R.L. Stein, the real one, a bigger cameo. And as well as that, they actually got some preteens to play it, other than college kids, because that's never how it worked in the original story. And one thing that I did like about it is that they didn't bring any of the original characters back, because they never really did that in Goosebumps, except for the monsters themselves. Um, but yeah, they also did not ignore the previous story as well, they still brought it up. Um, yeah, I also like some of the now and day reference, but also past references to uh, the previous movies, like, like it, for example. It made a cameo with a balloon, and 
Jack Black, heck, who was playing Arnold Stein, said, I knew I came with, up with that first, so that was a good scene. Um, yeah, there's so many, but, uh, but yeah, I want to keep this video kind of minimum, so I'm going to end here. If you guys enjoy, please give a big fat thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to make more of these soon, so see you, amigos, stay awesome.